a side that is young but full of belief, a side that has recruited well. 40 list changes since Ruzi arrived. They're going in absolutely the right direction, but so much similar could be said about the Saints. Yeah, I think they're ahead of the Saints at the moment. Saturday afternoon football is away. Max Gorn, as he did Holding last the man, week. Melbourne. Christian, Christian Petrarca has got uh, Shane Savage got him on, on him at the moment, so he just made, needs to make sure he watches him. He's a very offensive player. This year, tally for the season, 11 goals, 7. They punch forward again. Here's a chance. Petrarca, terrific to the skipper. Sensible, instant enough. And then Tyson just worked it back into the hands. The running teammate, Fisher, delivered to him. Petrarca amongst all of that on debut. And Jude Christian, Petrarca just walking around in front of you. Seriously, well-built 20-year-old. He's got a, uh, a body ready for AFL footy, this young man. And the one touch already. Well done to Elvira and Tony, Christian's parents, and Rob and Julian, brothers watching on, the two older brothers. Touched. Arms was there, Wagner, and now Petrarca. First meaningful kick of the football down to Frost. The young men combining, and then Frost missed the footy. Might have been a bit unlucky there, Christian Salem. It looked like he had first and last touch on it. Petrarca. Now to Jones. Long to Kent. Lost his feet, Dempster. Kent kept his. It'll give inside Petrarca. Kennedy has the footy in his hands. Somehow just slips out the top. Viney, Geary. Ross watches on Petrarca. That was clever on the left boot. At 15 28. You heard the umpire. All would be unbelievably proud of the journey of Christian. Knee reconstruction. Had to wait 520 days since being drafted for his opportunity. They're watching on nervously. It's in Watts and Hogan. I mean, they're all sort of marking tallish type players. Jack Viney, eight disposals in the opening turn. None in this set. Had to be perfect. Crashing on through was Akers. Spilt to Jenner. Over the top. Here's Petrarca. Hogan screaming for the ball. Yeah. Petrarca to Hogan. Well, how Demons fans hope that is going to be the sign of things to come. I've seen glimpses of this kid. And only glimpses this Petrarca. afternoon. Yeah. Yeah. But everything you see, you like. I mean, that was just a beautifully weighted kick, too. Lead. That was a really good play there by Jetta just to break through into the space, but it's just a really nicely weighted kick there to Hogan. On this ground against the Saints last year, his career high and Petrarca, 11 scoring shots to three. Here's Petrarca, a roar now every time he gets near the football, just a little slow that time. Just still right picking up the pace right of the right footy. Gets around the first yeah. one, not expecting that second player to come at him, but he'll learn quickly. Webster. Oh. Go up the middle. It was an ambitious kick. It was a poor Three. kick in the end. Garlet Petraka. Well, they have been roaring every time he's gone near the football. This will be disposal number eight. There's the family. Mum and Dad on the edge of their seats. And Mum Elvira gone. biting her fingernails. Dad can't watch Dad Tony a little cooler. They've watched a lot of junior football, I'm sure. It's it a whole football club behind him here and an army of supporters. The young talent emerging before our eyes. And he's offline. This is everything. And mum, a little smile. There'll be plenty more, I'm sure. He was drafted 520 days ago. He's had a knee reconstruction. He's broken his toe since. Won the Lark medal in the under-18s. Dominated for Vic Metro. Finally, he gets to live out his dream. He's an active AFL player. Here he is on cue. Bullets the ball inside. Not as he would have liked, mind you. But everyone you speak to says he's one of the most charismatic men they've met, owns the room. He's been compared in that regard to Dippier Domenico. Whether that's a good thing or not, I'm not sure, but the ball's on the outer side. Third man up was Ross. Ends up again with Petrarca. So he just keeps getting the footy now. That's disposal number 10. Pulera by Jetta, who needs to take Akers on and did. Important there. Up in front, Petrarca. Advantage, advantage. Not paid the mark, got the free kick. Off to Watts, here's Hogan for six. And that's just Jetta. I mean, that's really been created for the fact that Jetta got through 
that tackle, just got that extra bit of space, kicked over where St Kilda had all their defenders and then they found some space out the back to Hogan. By foot to Tyson, who's been quiet by his lofty stance. Petrarca, a long bomb, frost. So we saw McDonald, the vision was good. The kick tough in the end for Petrarca. Lost his feet, Geary was quick to his. Petrarca, brilliant, stole the football. No, against these demons. Stephen trying to keep that ball alive. Here's Petrarca in their column. They've won in most areas. Petrarca in his first game for the skipper and Jones. Steps inside, 50. Nice finish. Christian Petrarca, 16 disposals on Dabu. He's sitting down at the moment, Jude, but have you seen enough to think that he's got a very promising future in front of him? Yeah, I think I have, Baz. I think uh, you've seen, obviously, his body, but his movement around those stoppages and then give himself some time and space to deliver a footy inside 50. What about you, Tim? Oh, you yeah, know he's going to be a player. Look at all those basketball moves and the way he plays, too. But uh, he's going to be super midfielder. However you measure it, however you look at it, however you look at the form, 13 in a row is a big number. So the Saints win for the second time this season and reign supreme under the roof. And the skipper, Nick Revolt, was a huge part of it. And everyone played their part. That was out of bounds. 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 Can't be. It can't.